Welcome back to Gurung Pinoy. Today's topic are the different symbiotic relationships. When you say symbiotic relationships, these are the types of ecological relationships where you have two organisms that are closely interacting with each other. We have three types of symbiotic relationships, and these are mutualism, commensalism, and parasitism. We start with mutualism. In this type of symbiotic relationships, both organisms benefit, so both of them are happy. One common example for this would be your bee and your flower. In this case, the bee would get some nectar from the flower, and the flower, on the other hand, is pollinated by the action of the bee. The second type of symbiotic relationship is commensalism. In this type of relationship, one organism benefits while the other is unaffected. That means the other organism does not benefit nor is it harmed. One common example for this would be your orchid and a tree. In this case, the orchid anchors itself on the tree and also gets some nutrients from it. The tree, on the other hand, is not affected. The third type of symbiotic relationship is parasitism. In this type of relationship, one organism benefits while the other is harmed. We call that organism which gets benefits the parasite, while the other one which is harmed, we call that the host. In this example that we have here, we have a human arm and of course, a mosquito as your parasite. for watching our video. This has been Coach Mac. Do not forget to follow us on Facebook, YouTube, and TikTok as Gurung Pinoy. And you can also find us on Instagram as at Gurung Pinoy PH. And I leave you with this saying, maliit manabutin ng mga kaalaman, ang dulo nito ay malaking kaginawaan.